all of us have been broken at some point in our lives. Something happens that damages us badly, that we have to heal from, repair from, to regain our purpose. We lose parents or family. We lose friends. We burn out. Our careers might derail. We may get ground down over time by events. Something unexpected can hit us. Some of us live in countries torn by war or poverty. People are bullied, harmed, abused, mentally or physically. Any kind of trauma can be devastating. It leaves marks, leaves scars that never really go away. It can take a lifetime to heal. Some of us never really do. Kintsugi is the Japanese art of preparing something purposeful that has broken, often using a gold, silver or platinum lacquer. So you're not hiding what happened, you're making the vessel strong and whole again, but you're also showing the healing, making it part of the whole, making the old vulnerability part of the new strength. I've always loved the idea because you're not throwing something away or hiding it or pretending the damage never happened. You are using that breaking to enhance it, to make it unique, to give it new purpose. I think it is really important for us to realise that being broken is not shameful, that it's okay not to be okay. We have this conditioning in business and society where we feel we should hide our emotions, our problems, things that have happened to us, that we shouldn't share or show even with ourselves, that vulnerabilities are a permanent weakness. We have this idea that we should present this unbroken face to the world, whatever has happened to us, and it's ridiculous because we're people, we're human, our past is part of who we are. Hiding that it ever happened is even more damaging over time. I think we need to recognise that humans suffer but can heal and we should not be ashamed of what's happened in our past but we should learn from it. Being broken is not a failure, it's a lesson and by embracing damage as a philosophy it treats breakage and repair as part of our personal history rather than something to disguise. I think Kintsugi is a wonderful concept because we have all been broken or will be broken at some point and it will differ for each of us. We shouldn't repress it, we shouldn't hide it because this prevents us from fully healing. We shouldn't be ashamed of having been broken but we should acknowledge it happened and embrace the lessons it taught us because they make us who we are. It's an event in our journey, not the end. We can forgive ourselves and move forward with acceptance. Kintsugi as applied to people I think is amazing because it says you were beautiful and then you were broken and over time you have healed and repaired and now you are even more beautiful and unique than before and just as strong because of that damage not despite it. I think there's a lesson there. We can all be Kintsugi. <laughs>